I'm not surprised that the people over here in the West are complaining about a video game that's aimed towards adults. Saying that Stellar Blade is going to basically be over sexualized because of the female model and all this other shit. Now, Stellar Blade comes from the Shift Up company, which is the creators of Nikkei, the Goddess of Victory, which is a very, very popular gacha game. I wouldn't think that Shift Up will come out with a triple A fucking console game. I didn't know that they would do such a thing, but I mean, with all the money that they've made from this game, uh, yeah, it's not surprising whatsoever. But this is Nikkei. This is Nikkei. This is the anime butt jiggler shooting game right here, right? So they decided they'll turn it up a notch and go for making Stellar Blade. Now, Stellar Blade dev, also known for butt jiggling game Nikkei, says he put special attention into the female leads back because that's what players see most of the time. This is a game for adults. Remember that quote right there. So let's scroll on down here. Here you go. When it comes to design, we put special attention on the back of the character because the player is always facing the back of the character when they're playing, he said. That's what they see the most of. So we thought this was pretty important. Now, Kim is under fire. The whole dev team, the director is under fire from the West because you got those virtual sign signaling motherfuckers. And a lot of people who... I seen a video of it, by the way. I seen a video of some person asking what they think about Stellar Blade out in New York somewhere. And most of the people that they were asking looked like fucking trolls, ogres, deep sea creatures, orcs, and other unsightly creatures that shouldn't be walking this planet. It's always the people who don't play video games and look like fucking creatures of the deep that have a problem with a video game, a fucking video game. I I can't comprehend it. My self-esteem ain't that low, bruh, to where I'm gonna be like, oh man, that male character or that female character looks unrealistic, man. We shouldn't have it over here. We should censor the game immediately. No, I don't pander to that bullshit because I play video games for entertainment, for enjoyment. This next part that I'm about to read is the most important part of this article here because Kim talks about the cultural situation globally and in korea and i'm going to talk a little bit about south korea as well because they do things different out there as opposed to other places in the world so let's let me um let me read this real quick kim also reflects on the broader cultural situation surrounding characters like eve within both korea and globally and his own desires when it comes to games he plays and makes I personally think that compared to movies, animation, manga, and so on, people are especially strict towards games. In games, there's all views that people have which are not always positive about unrealistically beautiful characters. Honestly, when I play a game, I would like to see someone who's better looking than myself. That's Kim, that's the director, Kim. That's, that's him saying that. That's what I want. I don't want to see something normal. I want to see something more ideal which is correct as a man as a straight man i want to see something more ideal I want to see beautiful women with their ass cheeks flapping in my face hey that's my personal preference i'm an adult i think that is very important in form of entertainment this is after all entertainment targeted for adults boom drop the bomb mic drop walk out he should have walked out right then after he said that this is, after all, entertainment targeted for adults. This ain't games for little Timmy. This is not it. Stellar Blade, Goddess of Victory, Nikkei, which is made by Shift Up. This, these are games not made for children, bro. Oh, I gotta come back to that in a minute. Actually, let's get to that real quick. So, for those of you guys that don't know, this is the model that they scan for Eve, the main character of Stellar Blade. And then they enhance the booty, of course, which I'm probably going to use as the fucking uh, thumbnail for this video when it does come. Ooh, the quality is terrible, but I'll find something better. But this is this is the, the, the model right here. And let me just let you guys in on something. I love Asian women. OK, but what I do know is that in South Korea, appearance standards is astronomically high compared to appearance standards in Japan, China, or anywhere else on this fucking planet. 
they get work done to themselves. Not like how these hoes out here in the West do it. They do BBLs and they do their lips. And they, yeah, some of them get plastic surgery and boob jobs and all that. But no, it's way more, uh, it's acceptable. It's way more acceptable in South Korea than it is anywhere else. A lot of your favorite pop, uh, was it, uh, K-pop idols have work done to themselves because they have to uphold a appearance standard that is astronomically high over there. So this is the chick right here. She's the chick that they scanned and she is gorgeous. I would love to clap them cheeks, even though them cheeks are enhanced. I would, I would enjoy clapping them cheeks. Say what you want about me. I don't give a fuck, but I would tear them shits up. Anyways, uh, let's see. Is there any more? Is this? Oh yeah, this is her. She's gorgeous, bro. She's, I, I wonder if, well, I can't get demonetized because I don't make money on YouTube anyways. <laughs> this chick is gorgeous, bro. Like, bruh, imagine coming home to that. I don't want kids, but I would probably have kids when I'm done with her. Let's see. Stellar Blade, director, praises sex appeal triggers western media these are a whole bunch of videos from different content creators talking about the whole situation like i am my thoughts about it is i can't wait till it comes out i can't wait until stellar blade comes out and i'm going to play it with one hand or uh with my feet while i'm using both of my hands for other purposes i'm just playing but i am going to pre-order stellar blade and play it because i'm interested in playing it like i I like the combat. I ain't gonna lie to you. And the fact that I get to look at this beautiful female protagonist and all her back glory. Yeah, I am definitely, definitely, definitely going to be pre-ordering Stellar Blade. Straight up. Or if I don't pre-order it, I'll just buy it outright. So, yeah. But I just wanted to talk a little bit about this whole Stellar Blade situation. How the West wants the game basically censored a lot of virtue signaling and all that other bullshit it, like it's it's a video game bro and it's aimed towards adults what the fuck do you expect like get the hell out of here bro Yeah, we stop some interest on to the what now? Yeah, we stop some interest on back to that what now? This one back to the aunt now. Running up from the aunt now. Yeah. Yeah, we stop some interest on we back to that what now? Only money on this coming right out my compound. And I pop on that pill and I geek. Swear to God with that purple eye feast. Had a smack me away with that piece.